Yelena Grosheva from Russia. She's just 14 years old. And like all three Russians in this competition, she could win this event outright. They are so consistent, and none of them have a weak event. That's the amazing thing. She was 12th in the all-around at the World Championships this year. worth a 9.9 .9. you can really see she had to work for this because she wasn't in a position for a really perfect landing but she was not going to give it up you can really see a veteran in competition who are used to fighting for every tenth of a point and she saved one right here by not moving her feet Grosheva competed in the Junior European Championships this year. Just a junior, this is a very important senior meet for her. Fifth in the all-around there. She did not place on the vault. There's her score, a 9.637 for the first of these two vaults. Remember, the scores will be averaged. All of these gymnasts know how important every thousand of a point is in gymnastics. Remember, uh, Shannon Miller was second in the Olympics by just 12 thousandths of a point. So they really work for every tenth of a point they get. Excellent! A better vault, a better landing. It's really been interesting to see the Russian team here practicing all week. They're real loose. They used to be so intense, and their gymnastics is still spectacular. It's still great, and they're having so much fun. There's smiles on their faces. On the bars now, Potkopaeva from the Ukraine. This is Lilia Potkopaeva. Certainly one of the more beautiful gymnasts in the competition. She really pulled that handstand out right there because of her toe point and her elegance. She really has a nice presentation. Gorgeous full turn on top of the bar. She was six in the all-around at the World Championship this year. Very good routine. She just does not give away any tenth of a point in form deductions. So, Potkopaeva off to a good start. She was a finalist at the Worlds on this event, placing fifth. On the vault, the two-vault average for Yelena Grosheva, 9.669. Nine point seven five, the score for Lilia Potkopaeva. So let's take a look at the all-around standings after one rotation. Dina Kochekova with a nine seven six three in her first round holds the lead. Yelena Piskun, Lilia Potkopaeva tied for second. Shannon Miller in fourth place currently. Properly leading to lengthy delays in reporting individual scores. However, after the first rotation in the women's all-around, Dina Kochetkova of Russia leads Shannon Miller of the United States, who's in fourth place. The leaders are closely bunched at the top. Right now, let's rejoin Bart Connor and Kathy Johnson for the start of the second rotation. Now ready to perform from Ukraine, this is Lilia Potkopaeva. She had a 9.75 in her first effort here on the uneven bars. Off to a good start. She was shaky on this event in the team competition, only had a 9.375. And that's surprising. She is potentially very beautiful on this event. She has a high level of difficulty and really shows elegant choreography. Watch this mount. Notice how she's very precise in every single moment of this routine. That is beautiful. Pike open, lay out to a swing down. You can't help but think the coaches all around the world when they're talking to their young gymnasts and mentioning how you need to keep your legs straight and your toes pointed. 
All of them are talking about Lilia Potkopaeva. That's the example of how to do the proper technique and form. Oh, good save. It's a very good save, but any time a gymnast breaks at the waist over, that's normally a three-tenths of a point deduction, and that is very difficult. I don't know how she spins on her head and has any hair left. <laughs> may make for a bad hair day, no? Keep in mind how close these competitions are. Thousands of a point sometimes separate the medalists. So that was an unfortunate break, but this is a big dismount. Wow. Gorgeous full twisting double back with a very impressive landing. A little shaky there, but otherwise a strong finish for Potkopaeva. Now over to the unevens, Elena Grosheva. She had a 9-7 in her first event here, the vault. It's a great event for her. I want you to watch the height of her release moves. This is what is impressive. She is way up above the bar. And she'll perform another one right here. And watch, she finishes the move up above the bar before she regrasps. Once again, the Russians have such good form and really excellent clean technique. Makes for the big scores. She has a double front dismount. It's tough to land. Oh, she is right on with her landings today. It is uncanny that anyone can tell where they are in this type of dismount. It's a double front somersault. You really have to go on feel alone where that floor is. Look at that. She just locks into that position. The score for Putko Paiva on the beam earlier was a 9.587. The score over on the bars for Grosheva, a 9.825. This is her teammate, Oksana Fabrishneva. Everything she does, all the apparatus, she does with such ease, doesn't she, Kathy? And such elegance. It looks so effortless as she goes through the routine, which is obviously the goal of gymnasts. trouble with this pass in the warm-ups. See if she can do it. Three layout step outs. Perfectly done. All of her scores in the preliminary competition were between 9-7 and 9-8. Her first score here was a 9-5-3-7 on her wall, so she's a little behind what her schedule normally is. mind how devastating just a balance break can be on the balance beam of course you get the deduction for that but if it's on a skill that you need for your bonus points if the deduction is too great you don't get credit so then you lose another tenth of a point that you really needed enough just to stay on the balance beam anymore. They really need to be perfect. Here's a dismount. Very difficult. Came up with a great landing. Now on the uneven of bars, this is Anna Maria Bican from Romania. She had a 9-6-9-4 on the vault. This is disappointing part because that's her best event. She really needed a bigger score there, but that's beautiful work. The pirouette right into a release move. Clean execution. Very nice dismount. So many of the gymnasts are doing that dismount. The pike open into the layout position. Interestingly enough, she said her favorite gymnast is her competitor, Dina Kochetkova. 
We'll be back right after this. <laughs> 